Hi there! How to make a simple bushy garden look neat in Grenada? You know, Grenada has two seasons, the rainy season and the dry season. And in the rainy season, it gets very bushy. As you can see, I've got a cutlash and trying to cut all the bushes. You know, it's really wild, really, really wild. You know, um, we can't we cut the bushes every three, three to four weeks, which believe it or not. And um, so um, this is how it goes. But you know, nevertheless, if you enjoy working into a garden, you know it's it's really really worth it. And Mount Craven, especially where we live, um, is very very hilly, and it's got a lot of rocks. You know, nothing is wasted in the, in the garden. If you've got rocks, you've got pebbles, use them all. And this is what we've done. You know, and um, we barricaded the, the rocks to make your garden look, you know, nice and neat. You know, so um, so every three weeks we try and, and, and keep it like that. And, um, you know, and we do use a streamer as well, you know, uh, to sort of just get it really low to the ground, the grass, the grass is really, really high. You know, um, like I said, in the rainy season, it tends to do that. So, so the best thing to do is um, to use, you know, um, whatever, you know, instruments you've got for your garden and just utilize it. And as you can see, the flowers has been trimmed here, you know, and um, like I said, we do have lots of rocks, you know, big ones so um and you'll see that um i've utilized that to you know to barricade you know some other you know other flowers and um and put your flowers into pots if you can and so it makes makes it look neater as you can see here i've just done a little design like a zen garden actually it's a bit wild but um well, I like it like that. As you can see, you can see the rocks. It's, you know, it makes it look neater, doesn't it? And um, yeah, so and we've got the fence that that that, that you know separates us from the neighbors. And uh, there you are, can see all the rocks. Yeah, and uh, so used. You know, I what I did, I put all the rocks together. You know, scraped everything, the small, the pedals, the big ones. And, and this is what I did. And um, there you are, you know, a view of, overall view of how it looks like. And, uh, and flowers, we have got some flowers, but um, to show you on this video here, it hasn't bloomed yet. Look, yeah, you see how neat it is? On that bush I show you uh, at the beginning of the video. And you can put your flowers into baskets and um, little steps to go up because like I said it's very hilly up in Mount Craven so um, little steps to go up to the higher um, level of, of the ground and um, to observe and there you are it's neat isn't it yeah and uh, you have your herbs there and everything and uh, yeah there you are so it's not difficult really you know if you like gardening you know take your time that took me one day you know, like in the morning, I, I usually do it like when the sun is not out, you know, or late in the evening. And you tend to work much more faster and you not you don't get tired very easily. And the birds has come, you see, they, they come to sort of, you know, view and they like it. And the chickens. And, um, yeah, to collect all the, you know, the, the bits and bobs the, that's left over from the clearing of the garden. And a view. And it's called the flowery men pad. Thank you for listening. Don't forget to subscribe as usual and like and share to your friends. And thank you for listening. Bye now.